Hey, what's Mike? It's been a while. I'm actually on vacation. I'm down here in Vincennes, Indiana to visit some friends, but I decided to stay at the Super 8 here in Vincennes, Indiana. And so I'm going to show you my room that I got here. So, like I said, we're starting from the door. As soon as you walk in, there's my bag over there on the couch. And as you see, you walk in, hi, there is the bathroom sink. You have your cup, your towels, soap. You got yourself a room free, so that way you can get uh, another get room service if you want. You have a coffee maker. The coffee maker just that looks that like great, to be honest. So obviously I'm not going to use it. And then you got some other machine back there. I think it's a tea thing. And then you got yourself your hair dryer. I was a little curious about the coffee maker here, why it was so dirty looking. And then over here, you can see there's nothing to make coffee. You have like your stuff, like your sugars and that kind of stuff, your stirrers. And there's, also something, there's also nothing here to make the tea as well for the tea maker. But you open the lid here. Look at that. Nasty coffee grounds. Who knows how long they've been sitting there too. So, yeah. That's why there's no coffee grounds. But that's no excuse because they should, you know, clean this stuff. They should refill this if it's a habit. So, obviously, the housekeeping crew here does a horrible job, apparently. Like I said, and across from the sink, you have your bathroom. Now, here, the light is outside. It's not the best lighting in this bathroom, but you yourself your commode. You got yourself your shower tub. It does look a little clean. You have a bath towel, some soap, some shampoo. The one thing I didn't notice about this door here, as you can see, it is busted. So it's it won't lock. So as soon as you shut it, if you're in here by, thankfully I'm here by myself, but if you're not, you know, somebody just walk right in. And you got yourself a luggage rack, luggage rack right here, which I probably put that bag there. I got myself a king size bed. You got yourself an alarm clock. The alarm clock does not work for some reason. It doesn't. It's not turned on. It's not plugged. I'm not sure. I haven't looked. Much concern. You got yourself a storage. And across over here, you got some more storage. You got yourself a TV, which is a tad bit crooked. But you get, like I said, storage down here. Oh, there's a smoke detector. That is missing from up there. Oh, that's nice. You need some more drawers. You get yourself your uh, refrigerator and microwave. And a little desk. So if you're here working, you know, traveling for work, you can set up a laptop here and work from the, the hotel. My bottle of water that I bought for this weekend. My bag for the bottle of water. And over here, I said, there's the cup I was using, along with my Yeti mug. You guys have a telephone. And no Bible. I'm surprised. And there's my little charger. I said, and this is my bag. And this couch is not fold out. I checked. It's just a standard couch. And it's not too bad, actually. It's kind of comfortable. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't want to sleep on it, but obviously you could if you, you have somebody over. And that's it. All right, so I ended up moving the end table here, or the nightstand, and the alarm clock does work. Um, if you look down below, though, the outlet, though, doesn't look that great. Uh, it's missing part of the cover on there. Also looks like there's something down there. It looks like a cap from a drink as well. That was missed. But another thing I saw, if you look up here, the very top, that would be a sprinkler. So I'm not sure what a sprinkler is in the wrapped in plastic. That is a bit concerning as well. But then over here, I want to plug in my um, charger for my smartwatch. And this outlet has no covers at all on it. It's exposed. 
So yeah, that is not very good at all. Well, that's my room tour here at the Super 8 in Vincent, Indiana. And like I said, there's some sketchy things like the bathroom, like the bathroom door, for example, and then the smoke detector. But besides that, it's not too bad. I can't complain for the price. <laughs> and so until next time, I'll see you guys later on down the road.